Hello everyone, in this tutorial, I am going to show you how you can upgrade or downgrade your XAMPP PC version. So first of all, you need to make sure that you have stopped your Apache and MySQL and close your XAMPP. And first of all, I am going to show you my XAMPP version. So I will go to Windows search option and search for CLD. There you can see command prompt. And in the command prompt, if I say PHP, minus v then press enter it will show us our current xam version which is 8.2.12 so i'm going to show you how you can upgrade or downgrade your xam version so right now first of all you need to go to the folder where you have download or install your xam so for my case it's local leak c and here you can see the xam folder so we need to go inside the xam folder and in the xam folder you will see the apache and PC folder right so it is 8.2 right so we are going to rename this so I'll just right click here and I'm going to say here Apache 8.2 and then we'll go down and here you can see PHP again I'm going to rename this to PHP 8.2 so after this uh, we'll just minimize this then we'll go back to our browser and in the browser, we are going to search for jam version. Then press enter. Then we need to go down and we need to find this link searchforce.net. So I need to click here. And I will also give this link in the video description. Just check it out. So after coming here, you need to click on this files option. Click on files. Then go down and here you can see jam windows so we are using windows so i'm going to click here xamp windows then here it will show us all the xam version so let's say i want to downgrade my xam version from 8.2 to 7.4 which is this one so you just need to look for your specific xam version for my case it's this one 7.4 so i need to click on this folder or this version and once i click on it uh, it will take us to another page. So from here, we need to download this version, XAMPP Portable Windows 64. This one, the portable one. And it is a zip file. So download the XAMPP Portable Windows, the zip version. Just click on it and it will start downloading the zip file. Here you can see the download will start shortly. And there you can see the download started. And the file size is around uh, 200 MB. So this will take some time. Right now, I will just fast forward the video. Uh, so here you can see the download is complete. So we will go to the download location. So I'll just click here. And here you can see this is the zip file. So let me just cut it from here. And let me just put it in my uh, new volume E. So I'll just paste it here. There you can see. So we need to extract this zip file. So I'll just right click here and click on extract all. And I'll extract it uh, directly in the new volume E. So I'll just click on extract. And there you can see it started extracting. So it will take some time. Right now I will just fast forward the video. So here you can see the extract is complete. So right now uh, this is the XAM folder that we just extract. So right now we need to go inside this XAM folder. Then here uh, we need to find the Apache and the PSC folder here. So just select those two folder. Then we need to copy it. So I just copy it. Then we'll go to our uh, XAMPP folder, which is this one. Here you can see locally see XAMPP, and here you can see Apache 8.2 and PSC 8.2. So we are going to paste those folder over here that we just copied. So that you can see it is pasting here, and it is complete. So right now we need to go inside this PHP folder. So we go inside PHP. Then we need to find a file called php.ini. So here you can see php.ini file. So I'll just right click here. Then we need to open with, we can open it notepad or also Visual Studio Code. So I'm going to open it with notepad. So I'll just click here and there you can see it opened over here. Let me just zoom in a little bit. So here in this php.ini file, we need to search for something. So for it, we need to press Ctrl F. And here we need to search for XAMPP. So I'll just press Enter. And here you can see XAMPP. So here uh, before this XAMPP, we need to mention C and this clone. 
why we need to mention c clone because here you can see our xamp is inside the local leak c die that's why so there is around eight places where we need to do this so let me just copy this and then i'm going to search for xamp here you can see another xamp then i'm going to search for xamp again paste it here so this was three then this will be the fourth on then this is the fifth on this is the sixth on there is two more seven and this is the last on eight there is no more exam but let me just check it and there you go everything is done then save it ctrl s or click on file then save so we can now close this so after that if we just go to your command prompt and if we just write over here psp minus v then press enter here you can see our xam psp version changed to 7.4 previously it was 8.2 so this is how you can upgrade or downgrade your xam version in php i hope this was useful if you have any question or any suggestion just let me know in the comment section make sure to subscribe and i hope to see you in the future tutorials